NASA, by the way, is about to hit an asteroid, right? Just to test out whether they can hit asteroids or not, which is kind of sus. They mentioned time and time again, like, hey, guys, this asteroid, not on its way to Earth. Don't worry, which is fine. But why the f*** are they training to hit asteroids? You know what I mean? Like, what the f*** do they know? We are precision locked and still tracking Dimorphos. Yes. Nerds. Hey, NASA, how about y'all figure out how to f not stream in 1P? That's my f take on nasa okay they need to figure it the f out dude what is this shit? i can't even see the f nerds celebrating now we can't say this enough and i know you've said it so many times but it's worth repeating Demorphos is not a threat to earth nor will it be after impact right no that's right uh, uh this uh asteroid system is still almost seven million miles away from the earth uh, it's at its closest point in the orbit right now to Earth. So from th this point forward, it's going to be moving away uh, from Earth. So there's no chance of anything here. We've got to look for all the other unknown asteroids out there still. Guys, stop. Stop worrying about other asteroids. I promise. There's no other asteroids, okay? Just listen to my words saying that there are no other asteroids. <laughs> Now, we have a fun way for you to join our mission, and it is by signing up to be a planetary defender. Visit B What? y.com forward slash planetary defender what take the quiz and receive a certificate like this one dog they're conscripting us by debating us at the top of the fucking hour for the record for those of you who are just tuning in nasa is currently trying dart double asteroid redirect test so what their goal with this is to send a fucking asteroid uh there's asteroids that are not actually pr projected to hit earth at all but they're testing out a satellite that they're launching towards the little asteroid following the larger asteroid to see if they can redirect it now they've also maintained the position that these asteroids are definitely Definitely not going to hit Earth. They would destroy the planet if they were to hit Earth. They also keep saying there's no other asteroids that are going to hit Earth. We're, we're just trying. We're just testing it out. We're testing out what we can do about changing the trajectory of asteroids that may in the future be coming towards Earth. That's what they keep saying. What if they hit the fucking thing and then actually its trajectory changes and it's now actually coming towards Earth? That's what I'm afraid of. These fucking nerds, if they, have they mathematicianed that out? The ones that worry about come out from the same angle as the light of the sun and there's fuck all we can do about that dude shut up don't say that i don't want to even think about that where's oh, astro yeah. tigs when you need them where the fuck are you this is we have a literal phd in here that specifically studies this shit where are you astro tigs answer answer for the crimes of other nerds that do the same shit that you do answer us right now we want answers motherfucker the fuck no you said the only asteroid we have to worry about is apothis in around 2034. What the fuck? Oh, there is one. No. We got the certificate in Hoscord. This certifies that Marat the better party. No, you signed my brother up. What have you done? What if aliens attack? And I'm like, yo, we're out of here. Like, I want to put him on the, the billionaire asteroid evasion spaceship. Because, you know, we have a secret club of like the mega wealthy. You know, the wealthiest people on the planet. Me, myself included. The $3 billion homeowner. And I want to put Marat in there. And they're like, sorry. It says that Marat is on a list. Marat the better party it says is on the uh, asteroid defense brigade the alien defense squad because he became a planetary defender and i'm like no Murad, come with me and then they're like nope sorry he has to go defend he has to go defend the country and then it's like no and then i get on the ship anyway and it's like hors d'oeuvres it's getting no it no they put really me in austin in the planetary defense squad against our will my discord signed us up no so mr asteroid of austin is guiding it how dare you austin is actually a wonderful pilot he's just dog shit at driving 1100 miles away wait when it actually hits are we gonna see like the crust of the fucking asteroid because that's pretty sick overall this is a very important experiment is there are not many methods to redirect asteroids there's a weirder method like painting the asteroid black asteroid ends up absorbing more heat and radiating it away slightly shifting its orbit Did you guys hear that one of the experiments is potentially painting the asteroid black i don't even know if this can i mean this will knock it off of its trajectory however how much will it knock it off of its trajectory that sounds fake as fuck no i don't i don't believe that astro tigs who is literally literally a fucking uh, astrophysics uh, a physicist phd would be just simply lying in the chat about this will knock it on path to destroy the moon wait what shut up this is not going towards the moon you just made that up oh my god oh my god it's happening right 
It's passing by. It's passing the big one. And it's going towards the little one. It's passing the big one. Brace for impact. What if it misses? Bro, what if it's a fucking whiff, dude? How big is this thing? How big is this thing? How big is it, like, size-wise? Someone in the chat, tell me how big this fucking asteroid is. Looks to me like we're headed straight in. Ah! 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 It's getting closer! Oh, That's wow. fucking nuts. You can see the crust of it. What if there's an alien on it, dude? What if there's an alien wow. doing the Come to Brazil dance right now on it? What? Oh my gosh. Oh, wow. We're getting visual confirmation. Dude! All right. Impact! We got it? Come to Brazil! Planetary defense. Fantastic. Bro, you work for years and years and years on like this fucking project. And then when the moment comes, you don't have like a cool ass fucking way to celebrate. You did the wackest high five, brother. You knew this moment was coming. And that's the high five you got? God, these guys are such real nerds, man. Holy shit. Bro, imagine if dinosaurs had this shit, dog. That's right. And now they're just chicken nuggets. You know what I'm saying? Remember that. Humans, baby. Humans one, universe zero. Get fucked, dinos. That was fire. Next is when they find out that it's now heading towards us. No, that's not going to happen. I hope. I actually have no idea to know if that's true or not. The engineer is telling their boss that they... I need... A second, a second asteroid is headed towards the Pentagon, sir. <laughs> Literally watching Space 9-11 and you're laughing? Despicable, to be honest. I mean, yeah. We have to take the brave asteroid out of the trajectory. Astro Tig says, the asteroid is 170 meters across. It's also the satellite of an even bigger asteroid. 760 meters across where was it headed towards like obviously not earth but where the fuck was it going also what is that in freedom numbers orbiting the sun being no danger to nobody dude imagine we fuck that asteroid up it hits the sun and then the sun and gets angry and then sends an asteroid our way sends a fucking sun asteroid our way holy shit dude check out apophis in 2029 it's just orbiting around the sun right where's earth though oh is the blue one earth Oh, shit. Is the blue one Earth? Oh, that's a near miss. Oh, that's another near miss. Uh-oh. Oh! Apophis is a 1 in 380,000 chance of impacting Earth by 2068. Why not just nuke it? Why not send a team of coal miners and oil frackers to go up to the asteroid and put a nuclear bomb inside of it? That's the real question. I mean, I feel like I've heard that happen before. And certainly not astronauts, okay? Because those guys are whack. What the fuck would they know about oil fracking and coal mining? Which would be significantly harder to learn than motherfucking astronauts, okay? Yo, what if they, what if we disrupted something delicate here, by the way? I'm not even kidding. Like, what if we just fucking, what if we knocked it out of the park and it just like, like, it's now actually changed its trajectory and it's now heading towards Earth. It's pissed off. Space isn't that delicate, brother. Yeah, well, what if we made the aliens, man? For years of hard work. It's so funny that Marat, by the way, the better piker, does this exact same thing every day. In that exact same gear. In an exact similar fucking room. Working on, ironically, identical fucking ash, uh, satellites like that. That's what Marat does every day. We are showing that planetary defense is a global endeavor and it is very possible to save our planet what do you mean hey nelson what about climate change dog save our planet from what save our planet from what leaked save our planet from what motherfucker you can't say save our planet and leave it he just kept us hanging save our planet from what i texted marat i watched that dart shit boeing should have gotten that gig they know how to crush flying objects better than anyone stop Rob, I'm going to give you both a treat right now. We're going to play that 